Delphinium. Yeah. <laughs> Hello. Hello there. What you doing? Just pottering. Pottering. Nothing oh. major. Okay. <laughs> Lady Reeves. Look. Flash new t-shirt. Look, look, look. Flash new t-shirts. Yeah. Oh, you look the part now. Hubby bought me a new t-shirt. He thinks I'm skinnier than I am, which is really nice, <laughs> it but looks hey. It's fine. <laughs> Stop complaining. Oh. Hello everybody. <laughs> I'm back. <laughs> yeah, with us. After last month's problems, yeah, I'm back. Um, still just pottering, not doing a great deal, but it's nice to be doing normal things again. Mm. So, we thought we'd have a little walk around the garden, yep. show you what's going on. Yeah, you might hear some noises around, people are gardening. Mm, just getting the, doing the last things. of the gardening done. Yeah. In September and uh, yeah we're starting to, to lose the light and lose the plants yeah yeah my um hanging baskets don't look their best anymore they gone over a bit really yeah, they're still bushy though yeah they're usually a lot fuller than this though so, I don't know I've got plenty of tomatoes coming on though yeah we've got some ripe ones over here yeah and look at them hanging here and under oh, there. Some ripe tomatoes. Yeah. So we're going to have some salad tomatoes when <laughs> summer's almost over. Yeah. <laughs> Dahlias have done well this year. I didn't stake them very well though because they've all flopped. But I did put a great big thing in. But... So I don't know. I'm going to have to re. Show, You're not going to stake those properly. No, I'm going to have to rethink that next year, I think. Yeah. yeah going to have to get the secateurs out. My arum lilies never flowered. Even the ones in the garden haven't flowered. So I don't know what I'm doing wrong with them. Might have to have a rethink of those. The calla lilies did. They were lovely. Even got quite a fresh new flower this side. Mm, nice one there. But they've, like most things in the garden, they've come really late. Probably yeah, because the yeah, summer these was such do. A washout. Oh, it's been an awful, awful um, thing. Yeah. Yeah, there's still some colour down here and um, yeah. some floppy things. That looks nice. <laughs> yeah, I've dug that up from a gar from the garden. It's a pineapple lily, and it just wasn't doing very well. But I did watch somebody on YouTube, and they have theirs in pots. So we'll see what it does next year. These are new. There are three in there rose lilies absolutely beautiful from the picture one has come up two haven't and dad has got two up and one not and we switched bulbs so he's got two pink and one white and i've got two white and one pink so we're wondering if the pink ones have come up so hopefully the white ones will come up next year I didn't expect them to come up this year at all, but hey, more dahlias that look lovely. Mm -hmm. Hanging baskets a little, well, overgrown, bushy, or whichever way you want to put it. But it's still looking all right, considering the time of year. Yeah, but there are some um, geraniums in the top. I don't know what's happened to them. Not a lot. They could have died, I suppose, when I wasn't looking after it. I was watering it. I know you was watering it, but if you don't deadhead, it goes to seed, doesn't it? Oh, my fault then. No, I'm just saying it. <laughs> I'm just trying to think of reasons why they're not doing as well. Reasons to blame me for something. Oh, shush. <laughs> <laughs> my pom-pom dahlias, they're beautiful. I love them. Probably my favourite shape of dahlia, these are. And this, what is this? Hibiscus. So I've got two hibiscus in the garden, but they're both purpley pinky. And I saw this somewhere and I bought it. It was only cheap and it's white with pink throat. And I just think it's so pretty. It didn't flower last year, but it has this year. Mm. And your Nelly Mosa has come back again with a vengeance, hasn't it, after I pruned it? Yeah, it also has two showings a year. Yeah, it does. It, um, yeah. it seems to go 
crazy for the first one about halfway and then for the second one it yeah. goes mental crazy. <laughs> <laughs> the sec second showing is never as good as the first though. I mean, it just seems to be bigger but yeah. not so many flowers. Yeah so. But this is still, what's this one then? This is still that's, giving it some show. That's a, oh can't remember what it's called, it begins with D I think. So I'll we'll have to come back to that one. Yeah we will. <laughs> <laughs> not a foxglove, not a lupin, not a dahlia. Did you tell us? No, <laughs> that's a foxglove. <laughs> no. Right, you can see I need to do some deadheading. This is a phlox, the white one. So that needs deadheading. And so does the Veronica. But that was beautiful when it was all that out in flower. Mm. Yeah. So that's more the hibiscus, not the purpley one. This has gone crazy, even after I scalped it. What are you called? <laughs> Tell me, what are you called? <laughs> There'll be a eureka moment in any second now. No, <laughs> that's not the right. The Japanese maple label. isn't looking too uh, clever. No, I, th I think it's too hot there for it. Might have to move it because it's scorched, isn't it? Mm. Yeah, there's another tag at the back there. It might be, look. There's another tag right at the back there. That might be the one you can't remember. <laughs> it's like a treasure hunt. No, that's from when I had that um, purple rose. That yeah. needs coming out really, but it's tied on. This has done really well. The Strantia, it's lovely. And, and the this hostas are still holding in, just. Well, this one's been munched on, look. <laughs> yeah, they're all about <laughs> Poor thing. But yeah, they can't complain for the summer year. No, no, they're and, lovely. And the maple's still doing okay. It's beautiful. And my unruly bush, where I chopped it back, it's sort of gone more greeny now. Yeah, they're uh, new shoots, aren't they? Yeah, rather than the sort of silvery sheets. Yeah. Hmm. But, but yeah. they'll turn, they'll turn oh, the yeah. original yeah. colour. But that'll come back with a vengeance, that'll be just as big next year. I yeah. It. And that's the cistus, and I've completely cut that back, but it has um, greened out again. So, yeah, that's doing all right. And this looked as though it was dying off, but it's come back since I moved it. Mm. It's growing new shoots, so, and this is going yellow again. Maybe it's not getting enough light. But it's not meant to get a lot of light. I don't know, maybe I'll just have to try it in a different spot. Yeah, mm. these have done well. And the white hydrangea, obviously it's all going over now. Mm. And yeah. the dead olive tree is still... The dead olive tree is doing all <laughs> still right. Still cracking on, yeah. yeah. And the bamboo since I've moved it. I mean, I, when I first put that back in, I thought oh, I should have kept the other one and put the two in there. But to be honest, that's filling a gap nicely. Now. No, it's doing all right. Mm, yeah. It's greened up, it's yeah, looking good. Yeah. Mm. This area's had a little bit of a tidy up and a cut back. Daisies have been cut back down there. Yeah, because they were looking a mess. Mm. So I've cut them down to where it was yeah. growing new shoots. Again, hostas. I've tidied that up. Well, yeah. This didn't flower this year. It's going to be hidden by the geranium. Look, I might have to rethink that and replay, yeah. put it somewhere new. Yeah, a bit of a trim here. Yeah, and already it's bushing. Yeah, and those little sprigs that are in the back, I forget what you did, are those fern type things. Are still bees. All oh, right. They're yeah. really bushed out now. Yeah, they're not very happy though, but I think that's because they were moved. But they they disappear to nothing and we'll come back fresh next year. Mm. My firework agapanthus, they've gone over, so I've chopped off the blooms mm -hmm. so that the goodness goes back into the bulbs. And the white feathers, white feathers, is still not white, it's green. <laughs> So I'm wondering if they've sent me the right hosta. But yeah, this is re-bloomed. I cut everything that was dead off and it's still going, the Armeria. Mm -hmm. Yeah, 
Now the peaches. Dad's peaches are proper size now and turning the right colour. My, <laughs> mine are just not growing. Just never, they, they get to about that size and then they start dropping off yeah. and get eaten. They just never no. do what you want them to do. No. You'll never really be able to eat them. No. And this was a Hebe and I've just cut it back. Same with that one under there because it was just looking a real mess and flopping. So I thought, right, let's chop it down. And this is the other um, Aram lily that just hasn't flowered. And there's no signs. Mm. It, uh, I don't think it's going to. Look at these. Double lilies. Never seen them before, but they are stunning. And they've been the right pain in the backside as well because every bit of wind <laughs> yeah they flop <laughs> they just want to hang over yeah yeah we've tied yeah. them so many times and the gladioli as well that's yeah. yeah we had some strong winds over the past few days and yeah, um, yeah but look really at the color of wind. these yeah absolutely beautiful so it's a real shame but yeah you can see look it's snapped yeah oh yeah, yeah. unfortunately they're not very strong no Hebe I chopped back as well so yeah everything's just beginning to tip over now getting ready for autumn yeah that hydrangea is completely gone the geranium still I keep deadheading and it keeps sending well, me new buds there's new buds there yeah, yeah there's one over here look yeah, so it's still and doing in here right. so it's doing okay yeah yeah but yeah the hydrangeas i'll show the two in the front as well because they're still big and bushy and look great but they are yeah. starting to turn now yeah and again this is the other hibiscus mm -hmm. but they do keep going until the frosts mm. yeah oh, it's somehow i need to get rid of all this dead stuff without killing the plant <laughs> <laughs> pansies and then, are really good not not pansies the um Pinky thing, those. These? Yeah. They've given a great show this year. They've been brilliant, haven't they? Petunias. Petunias, that's, that's it. it. Yeah. Bad as you. Yeah. And we've still got a little bit of colour in the beds as well. And these are petunias. And see, this colour lily didn't flower either. No. And we didn't so. get that many strawberries either. No, we only had a handful, didn't we? And we never mm. did get any peppers, but there is a couple of flowers on it now. Well, it was getting eaten at the beginning, wasn't it? Mm. Yeah. And this was an Angelonia that I actually bought to put in the hanging basket. But when it came, it was so tiny, I thought I'd better put it in here. It's just beginning to bush out now. We've got Biggles playing now. Yeah. Hello. Hello. <laughs> and then we're... He's a bit low. It's not 400 metres in the boat. <laughs> mm. And then right. we're back where we started. Distracted. Yeah, I've got to have a look here because um, we had some peppers. We ate them. Not not peppers. Spring onions. Spring onions, yeah. I planted one in here. Oh, it seems to have gone. Yeah. Oh, some ink's at it. Mm. Apparently, the guys next door were saying there's a, a squirrel that's destroying things at the moment. Oh, is there now? Yes, and oh, Ted's found a twig. Where are you going? Oh, like? what are you doing, Ted? He says, I'm just tidying up. Ted's, <laughs> yeah, he's, he's, what are you doing? He's got himself a twig and he's, yeah, he's more than happy now. <laughs> <laughs> Crazy boy. Mm. Yeah, so that's it, really. I know everywhere needs a good tidy up, but I'm going to have to wait a little while to do that, I think because that's more than just pottering. Yeah, it's looking pretty good. But yeah, it's not bad. Mm. It's been lovely to recuperate out here though. Mm. It's been fabulous. Yeah. yeah. So there we are, those sunny. up to date. Yeah, today's been one of the better days, hasn't it? Mm. Yeah. Exactly. So, okay, well, I'll say goodbye for now. Hope you're all okay and still enjoying your gardens. Why not? While the sun shines, can't moan. <laughs> all right, take care of yourself and I'll see you soon. Bye. What's that plant?
Delphinium. <laughs> Delphinium. Remembered. Delphinium. Yeah. 